everyone, my name is Birdie and I am your friendly neighborhood forest witch. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you some items that I will be taking with me on vacation, specifically items that I use for my witchcraft practice. Now, if you'll also be going on a road trip this year, I did already post a video of a safe travels charm bag and a car spray. So if you missed that one, I'll link it up above here and down in the description. Definitely go check that out. But in today's video, these will be items that I'll be taking with me while I go to a cabin for my birthday weekend. I'm really excited about this and I thought I'd share some witchy items that I bring with me while camping. So without further ado, let's get started. The first items I bring on vacation with me are some crystals. So I have this beautiful opalite crystal and this is good for anti-depression. I've actually been really depressed lately so I've been trying to do things to help me with that. And then also this is one of my favorite crystals in my collection. It's citrine and this is good for positivity, happiness, self-esteem, and creativity. I absolutely love this crystal. It is so beautiful. And then the last one I'll be bringing is this beautiful blue opal and it generates soft and soothing energy to reduce tension and clear unnecessary thoughts from the mind. And of course, you know I love this one because it's in the shape of a bird. So cute, absolutely love this. I'll also be bringing some items to cleanse and protect the cabin. So first up, I have some rosemary incense and these will be great to cleanse the cabin. And then I'll also be bringing some ground cloves. I love working with clove. It's my favorite herb to work with. And this I will sprinkle along the door frames for protection. Then anytime that I go on vacation, I always like to bring some form of tarot deck or oracle card. This time I'm bringing my brand new deck called Folk Cards of Destiny. I'm really excited to use this one and I want to pull a card for my birthday to find out what the upcoming year will look like. Next, since we'll be in the woods and we'll be doing some hiking, I definitely wanna bring some jars for foraging and collecting. So I'm, I'll be bringing this jar for dry items. And then I also have two jars that I use for liquid collections. For this vacation, I'll also be bringing along a candle. And I thought since it'll be my birthday weekend, this Taurus candle from Dollar Tree would be the perfect one to bring and light for my birthday ritual. And then I also like to bring my nature journal along with me. And along with this, I also bring some sort of camera, whether it be my cell phone camera, my Polaroid, a digital camera, you know, what have you. I really like taking pictures of nature and then putting it in my nature journal to do some sort of research, whether it be on florals or herbs or animals, what have you. Then speaking of which, I'll also be bringing my bird watching journal as well. I believe I had picked this up at Ollie's. It came within a kit, but it's really cute. I absolutely love this. So inside it says date, start time, end time, location, weather, habitat, and observations species list. So I thought this was really cute and would be perfect to bring along with me. And it even gives you a little snippet of some different birds that you can look for. So yeah, I thought this would be perfect to bring along. And then this time I'll also be bringing along a modern camper's guide to the great outdoors camp sunset. And this book specifically I'll be bringing along because it actually has some foraging information in here. Let me see if I can find it here. Right here, it says foods to forage and it tells you all about those specific herbs that you can forage. It gives you recipes in here. It teaches you how to 
uh, build a fire, how to descale fish and prepare them to cook, um, different activities that you can do with you and your family. It teaches you about different water activities that you can do. Uh, different crafts that you can do. So I really love this book. If I can find it on Amazon, I'll link it down in the description for you so you can go check it out. But this is a great book to take with you while camping. Next up, since it'll be my birthday, I'm also bringing along The Hidden World of Birthdays by Judith Turner. And this book lists every single day of the year so I really want to delve into my birthday this year and discovering what my birthday means to me. So my birthday is April 21st. So here's the page for that one. So I'll be reading that. And then last but not least, I'll actually be bringing a book along that my husband purchased for me. It's called the birth date book. And I covered this up here because it's got my sensitive information, but this delves into my personal natal chart. So the time and place that I was born, all my zodiac signs from sun, moon, rising, uh, Venus, Mercury, and Mars. So I'm really excited to delve into this. It goes into really specific detail on everything about six of the signs. So yeah, I'm, I'm really stoked about looking into this and reading this. Like I said, this weekend, I really want to delve into my birthday and discovering more about myself. So I thought bringing this along would help me do that. But that is the entirety of this video. I hope you all enjoyed it and maybe got some ideas on items that you can take with you while you're traveling this year. But thank you all so much for watching this video. Be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks guys. Bye.